Welcome to Buffalo Alive, your boy Jay Still, Mr. Still About Money, if you want to be proper. I have a special guest with me today, Mr. Jada Bliss, Justin Draper himself. How you doing, sir? Doing good, my man. Good One of the premier you. trainers in Buffalo, New York. For those who don't know, me and this man go way back. I'm talking college days when I used to part it quite heavily. <laughs> but now that we're on a healthier tip right now, we want to get people right for the new year. Right. I know you're going to work out Yasmin a little later, yep. but right now, what can we do nutritional-wise to get people on the right track for the new year? The first steps you want to take when you're working on nutrition is you want to be able to track your food. You need to know what you're taking in in order to make small changes along the way. So the first thing I have my clients do is track their eating patterns for the first three days and then I can manipulate it and adjust it according to their goals. So for you, for instance, if you haven't been working out in a while, the first thing I would have you do is make sure that we're having proteins at each meal, okay? So your protein sources can be, you know, egg whites, chicken, ground turkey, um, low-fat cottage cheese, Greek yogurt, just to name a few. And then what I would want you to do is get a consumption of vegetables in, two to three a day. Um, you can have, you know, blueberries, strawberries, bananas. Now that sounds more like breakfast. What if, okay, I can't get a good breakfast in. Is there, is lunch important? Can the dinner help me still? Or do I just lose out if I can't get breakfast, lunch, and dinner? It's really predicated on your overall calorie intake for the day. The timing doesn't matter as much as it does the caloric intake that you're taking in. So be more concerned with the amount of calories that you're consuming versus the timing. Okay. okay. So if you're working out maybe later on in the evening, you want to say the majority of your carbohydrates for before and after your workout to make sure that you're eating for performance and recovery purposes. That's a good tip because I know a lot of people they do well they try to eat well rather and instead they give themselves the wrong energy for the gym. You know, sure. You're sluggish in the gym, yeah. you, you don't have that extra boost to go that extra rep. So right. that is a, a real good key tip right, right there. So right, right now what we're intaking, yep. right? Um, balance out. It, it, it's all, it, it actually comes down to balance. Balance of your macronutrients, your, your protein, carbs, and fats. And based on the energy expenditure that you're doing, whether you're somebody that works out an hour or two a day or haven't done anything at all, you need to basically take the right amount of calories that's gonna basically fit your lifestyle and your needs. Okay, now let's go worst case scenario. I'm out of shape, I'm terrible. What can be a example breakfast for me to try to get back on that right track for the new year? Um, I would probably say, again, stick to a leaner protein source. Um, I have a lot of clients that take either a protein shake, whey protein, or have egg whites um, for a carb source. They can have oatmeal, all right? They can have some type of fruit. So it could be, you know, blueberries again, or strawberries or something like that. Um, if they need some um, healthy omega fats, they can have um, some flaxseed oil. Okay. Or they can have a whole egg because you need essential fatty acids in order to be able to burn fat as well. Now, I know there's a lot of players out there just like me. Now, you got your lady over, you want some dinner, mm -hmm. but you want you guys to eat healthy and be yeah. fit. Yeah. What's a good dinner suggestion to keep us on the right track? I would stick to something like, you know, maybe like a lean steak, maybe like a filet, or you can even go like the fish route and get like, you know, a swordfish. You can get haddock, um, snapper, or even if you want to do some surf and turf, you can oh, do that as well. Oh, we're surfing and turfing. You got <laughs> surfing and turfing. <laughs> now, I know you're going to work Yasmin out in a few yeah. minutes. I'm going to enjoy some of this protein shake because I didn't eat breakfast today. So my man Justin looked out for me. Justin, again, thank you for having us over at the Pleasure. facility. Pleasure. Please work her out as hard as possible. I got you, man. I got you. Okay, so new year, new body, right? You need to get that summer body on. Well, Justin is gonna help us do that. He's gonna show us some workouts that you can do at work, at home, without weights. Very simple, just to get you started, and then you can come see him to get that real, real, real good summer body going on. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you a couple simple, effective workouts that you can do at work, and like you said, at home, okay? So the first thing we're gonna do together okay. is gonna be a squat into a curtsy, okay? I need that. Look, I, I don't <laughs> right for the glutes and the hamstrings. So for the glutes and the hamstrings. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna have our feet at shoulder width apart. Okay. All right. Toes are pointed out slightly. Okay. All right. We're gonna keep our chest out. We're gonna squat backwards through our heels. Squat all the way down. Get down there. Yeah. Good. I want you to come up. I want you to take your leg all the way across, keeping your shoulders square, and then coming back to a squat. Good. And let's go back over to the other side. Good. Let's repeat that now. Ready? Down and over and down. And over, good, get in the rhythm, good. You're doing it too fast. <laughs> down, and over, you gotta keep up here, down. I feel like I got a badonkadonk already. Good. <laughs> down, and over, good. Let's go, 10 more seconds, ready? One, good, 
Pick it up. No, pick it up. Here we go. Come on. Feel the burn. Let's this go. This is why you need him good. as a trainer. And last one here. And good. Ooh. All right. So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to go right into a push-up, right? I'm going to give you two different forms. Okay. One's going to be a regular push-up here. Okay. I want your hands underneath your body. Okay. We're going to break here at the elbows, keeping the abdominals nice and tight through the movement. Come down slowly and then explode up. <laughs> if, you're having, if you're having trouble with that, you can just drop to your knees. Okay? Here we go. Drop okay. to your knees. Let's yeah, come, I need my knees in it. Let's come right down. Come down slowly and then push it out. One. Down. Two. Down. Three. Down. Here, you got it. Let's go. Four. Down. Let's go. Five. I want five more. Ready? Go. One. Good. Two. Good. Three. Good. Four. Good. And five. Good. Right up. Here we go. We're going to go right into the next exercise. I'm dying. <laughs> No, Already. here we go. Okay, now we're gonna do a forward lunge. Okay? We're gonna do alternating. We're gonna start with our left leg first, okay? We're gonna step all the way out. Okay? Make sure that your knee does not travel over your toe. We're gonna push right back to the start position and we do the other leg. Good. And over. Good. You can have your hands on your hip. Good. Or hands in front of you, either way. Okay? Really concentrating on pushing back through the heel, keeping your body perpendicular to the floor. And keep it very slight, bending your knee when you come back to the start position. Ooh. How you feeling over there? Like I'm about to die. <laughs> How you in feeling? a good way. Come on, keep it up. <laughs> keep it up. You gotta get that body right for the new year. Good. Here we go. Good. Good. It's that Jada Blitz workout. It's that Jada Blitz workout. Come on. Good. Keep going. Let's go. Don't stop. I'm with you. Don't stop. Good. Let's go. Next one, right? Good. One more, guys. Let's go. Pick it up. Boom. Last one here. Last one. Good. All right. Again, no break. No break, guys. Okay, you can get a break after the circuit this and we're gonna you repeat that. <laughs> You're gonna get a break after this one and then we're gonna repeat that again, okay? All right, let's go down into a plank position. On the back of your forearms here. All right, we're gonna come up into a push-up position. Hand here, hand here. No anti-rotation of your hips. Stay square to the floor at all times. Come back down and repeat. Good, down. Oh, shoot. Good. And repeat, good. Fight through it now, fight through it, let's go. Come on, we can fight through it, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Ready, right up, up. Good, come right up. Good, give me one more, one more, one more, down. Good, hold it right here, hold it guys. Hold it, yep. Hold it down there, good. Good, nice. This is five seconds in and I'm about to <laughs> This is what you need, this is what you need. You this need that change, you need. you need that lifestyle change. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Last exercise. Last exercise. Okay, let's lay down here. Okay. Okay. Laying down sounds great. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do an abdominal crunch here. Okay. Everyone's done a form of a crunch before. Okay. I want you to lean back all the way. Cover feet at a 90 degree angle. All right. Hands across your chest. Keep your chin tucked in so your spine is nice and neutral. We're gonna drive our stomach down as we come up. Hold it, come back down. Small range of motion. We're gonna go for 30 seconds. Good, keep going. Grabbing that stomach through the floor. Good. 10 seconds. And last one. Good, pop right up. Good. <laughs> How you feeling? Hey mm. <gasps> Amen, hallelujah. And that's one circuit. I like to perform that at least three times, guys. All right, if you can't do it the first time, work up to it. Gradually increase your, your, your energy that you're producing right there, and we're good to go. And here's the thing. This is why you need a trainer. This is why you need to come to Jada Blitz, because I wouldn't even be able to do two push-ups if it wasn't for him encouraging me. Because I'm I have no arm strength. So, you know, if you're trying to get right for the new year, this is what you need to be. Come see us.